Yeah, and we're here today just to talk about some of the new things. Starts the day off with a bang. Are the performers with Goose as well have branched off into a new area? Usually I wash it out. Hi, welcome to Backstage Pass. We are standing outside in front of the Detroit Lakes Community and Cultural Center and we are here to talk about all things Polar Fest. We are so excited to be involved in this um, great event that happens um, throughout the community with a bunch of different service organizations and groups taking part. And um, we have a full list um, happening starting with um, Friday, February 5th. Yes, it's the Daddy's Little Sweetheart Dance yeah. annual every year. It's a lot of fun. It's for girls ages 2 through 12 and it's for you know, they can come with their daddies, their grandfathers, uncles, special mm -hmm. friends. Yeah. Um, it's a night of dancing, music, snacks, and just a lot of fun. It is It is so much fun. And I love your tiara, by the way. That is part of the princess package, I believe, yes, correct? It is. Yeah, so if you're, um, if, you have, if you're interested in coming, you're seeing this at the start of the week, you can still get tickets and mm -hmm. um, you can go register online for those. So it's a really, really great event. And if you haven't been or participated, I really encourage you to do it. It's lots of fun. So. It's a night to remember. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> and then also the, in the week leading up, before we, have, we talk about some of our other events, we have another show. Yes, we have uh, Daughters of Africa is in the theater on Tuesday the 9th. February 9th and that is another mixed blood theater show cool. they do um, such a great job they do and they're yeah. amazing shows and I encourage people who if you want to see something different you won't be disappointed yeah. they are great shows if you came and saw Minicanos you know what a great production it is yeah. so that's um, really great and they're out of the cities yep they're they, out of the cities yeah. yep yeah so. so it's really it's a really great event and then we kind of go into we kind of switch gears from the theater and we get to bring Pete, Pete. Pete. yeah by the way Pete will be at the girls uh, girls if you're watching this Pete will be at the dance to take some photos so um, Polar Pete makes his makes his appearance kind of throughout the thing so we have um, on Friday we have our iced tea golf and yes. you have your putter ready yes, to go I'm ready to <laughs> I've got my scarf and my and uh, my putter and I'm ready to golf yes iced tea is on Friday February 12th um, noon is the lunch and then right after that we get out go on the ice and you know like Kim and I have said in the past if we take off time Fridays to go golf in the summer why not take it off in the winter absolutely right? <laughs> absolutely so, um, come and join so, us yeah, yeah. Zorba's has a great yes, buffet that they serve they serve for us starting at noon and so um, anybody who's participating gets a chance to do that and it's just a really great great time yeah so if you're interested come see us at the community center um, if you can before Friday that'd be great uh, we have definitely have room available so come join us on the ice yeah and it's always fun each year to kind of see what Terry Wagner does our excavating yeah. on the ice it's always interesting year to year what he's gonna put together for us for a golf course so it's yeah, lots of fun so absolutely. depending on what mother nature hands mm -hmm. us too so we'll have snow. yeah yes we will and at the at the golf event um see willie miles will be joining us on the ice he um he is from he's from the south from but alabama. from alabama but um attended school in minnesota yes. and at st cloud yep. state and so he has if you haven't if you didn't see him last time he is hilarious and he's actually coming that night so i'm sure he'll have a few jokes to insert <laughs> um, after being on the ice during the day so yeah, he's teeing off at ice yes, yeah, right? yeah. He, said, he said i'm not finding my ball. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm, I'm going backwards yeah, exactly. So, yeah, so he he's a comedian that'll be in that night and yep. so we're really looking yeah, forward to I'm having a, him back. At 7:30 on February 12th, he will be at the Home Theater and he's he's very funny. Yeah. It's a clean show. Yeah. It'll be perfect for a Valentine's Day date yeah. night. Absolutely. So come so see him. Come see him and that'll be great. And then the next morning, um, kind of the last activity that we participate in um, as a center is we have the freezer buns run again. P will be there running away. Running away high five on the, the finishers as they come across <laughs> they come across the line so um so that's our f annual freezer buns run 5k this is a hat i'm wearing from a couple years ago and um, we have another really cool hat this year um, i don't have a sample of but we're really excited about that um lake shirts has done a great job getting us some of that swag again so we um, will have a hat to the first hundred participants that come out so if you haven't registered um you can register online um or you can stop in and do that um it's just 16 dollars through february 10th after that it's about 20 dollars so um but so yeah, so come on out. It's a great 5K and it's, such, um, it's so much fun. It is it's something different. It's so different yeah. than an average average 5K. Yeah, so exactly. Yeah. We do have people that do walk it, um, and uh, there there is always the option. Last year, I know we had a couple walkers um, that walked inside if it was too cold. So just come on out and um, participate and get active, and um, it's a lot of fun. So so thank you guys. It's a we're looking forward once again to Polar Fest kicking off again on February 5th. And um, if, for more information on the community center events, you can check us out online at www www.dlccc.org.